Okay. And I do believe that we are recording now. So welcome everybody. I'm Nicola Faye. I'm glad everybody can get on tonight. Um, I'm going to go through and just show you guys um, how to do some basic stuff with the Thrive Coins. I know um, it seems to be super difficult and I'm sure it is because um, this is still new to a lot of us. It came out, um, they showed us on the incentive trip last January that the system was going to come out in February. So it's still kind of new to all of us. So I wanted to help explain to you guys um, a little bit more in depth about the Thrive system and how it works. Um, and I logged into my own screen, and as you guys can see, um, on, your, on everybody's dashboard, you'll have um, a bar right here that will go between silver, gold, and lux. Um, every month we can get different Thrive points um, based on certain things that we do. And let me show you guys, um, you'll see throughout the month, you'll get your badges. Your badges will come up and through. And when you click on those badges, it'll tell you how you earned those badges and how many points they were and then what day you earned them. And actually, you can see I earned this one from Brittany. Brittany um, submitted her first event for 250, yeah. <laughs> and so I, I get points for that, as well as herself. Um, at any point, you guys can go into where it says My Badges. Um, and it's going to show you all your lifetime badges, um, current harvest year and last harvest year will all be right in here as well. And I, you, if you want to look at all the badges and what they mean, you just click right up here. And it's going to break them down by category. And again, I believe if you click on them, they'll tell you how you earn them. So we earn badges through um, our own personal sales. Once we hit 500, 1250, or 3000, we automatically get points. Um, if you bring on a new team member and they hit their fast start 750 or 1400, you get points as well. Um, oh, excuse me, that's your own. Those are your own fast start. So when you're new, you'll get those. When you choose to build a team, you also get points. When they submit to 50, 750, and 1400, you will also get points. When you promote, we get points that are all different levels. And then there's various other ways that you guys can earn points as well. Um, like if you're brand new at the company, you can earn the budding superstar award. Um, I believe the criteria is that you do, um, I think it's six events within your first 90 days and there's a certain amount of volume that you should reach. Um, Rick announces these on the all call, all call and he'll talk about them and you'll also get a dash. You'll get this show up on your dashboard. Um, when you go to five, go to meetings, qualified events, when you sell one wine club in a month or five or so many a year, you can get that. When you attend regional meetings or our national convention, you'll get it as well. Or if you become Luxonista for the entire company, um, that is an award that's awarded to one person out of the entire company each month. It's based on nomination from your leaders. Um, I was very honored. I, was, I got this back in February of 2014. Um, and Heather Kess has gotten it in Gina Devine as well. And that's, that's basically it for Great Expectations. So we would love to have some of you guys in that as well. Um, when you guys do your training, you guys can get some of these points. So these are just various different ways you guys can earn those points to get up to gold, um, silver, gold, and lux. Now, what does that mean? So if you get between zero and... 100 points in one month, that's considered silver. Um, when you get between um, 100 and 200, that's gold. And anything over 200, over 300 to me, is lux. And um, those points will convert, those coins will convert to points. And I'll talk a little bit more about that in just a little bit. Um, I want to show you guys for those of you guys that like to plan, we do have this thing called the Thrive Planner. As you can see, I clicked over here to my left. If you click on your Thrive Planner, you guys can actually plan out what you want to do for each month. Um, this is really important if you guys are trying to accomplish goals or if you're working towards that incentive trip, you can plan out each month and see where you want to be. Like you can see for my November, I had planned for 180 and I believe I ended up at 230, but I had my wine anniversary. Um, I achieved certain levels 
And what you guys can do is you guys can go in there and manipulate it yourself. So, for example, my December, I plan on hitting at least 500. Well, now I've booked four tastings. I know I'm going to hit higher than that. So I'm going to go into Boost. I can pick up that badge and place it in there. And it's changed. Um, I also know Brittany, who's on here right now, she's going to hit her 1,400 in December. So I'm able to go through each level and plan out where I want to be or what I need to be or what I know I will have. And you guys can plan your months out. It's also going to show you gold, silver, lux, or whatever. And we'll talk a little bit more about why you guys want to achieve lux here in a little bit. But, um, let's go into um, your rewards. Um, as I talked about earlier, guys, all of our Thrive coins, which... Our dashboards aren't always correct at how many Thrive Points we have. Um, the company is working on getting that done. Um, let's see if mine line up. Mine do line up. Mine says 101, 901 right now. Um, when you go to rewards, you will also see up here your coins in your pocket. If you click that, it's going to show you the history of how many coins you've earned each month. Um, and I wish they had the graphic up, but I can post this later on. Um, if you achieve less than 100 points in a month, you don't get to keep those coins. Those coins disappear at the end of the month. Um, so, if you so only if you achieve silver and above do you get to keep your coins, which is really important because you can redeem those coins for incentive trips, um, purses, more wine, gear, anything you want. So, it's really important that you guys are working to get higher than... Um, than than 100 points. Between 100 and 200, as silver, your points convert at 1.25. So if you earned 100 points, they'll end up in your, your coins earned as 125 points. Does that make sense? Um, if you earn gold, those points are gonna convert to coins at 1.5. And you, if you convert lux and above, it converts at 1.75. So they make it way better. It, it weighs more if you hit lux and above. I know um, when I hit director last year, um, I had over 800 points, lux points, and those converted to like 1,400 and something, some odd points, which was pretty darn cool that month. So again, I am right here in my rewards planner. If you guys look in your back, um, look at you guys have a market. You guys have several places you can spend your coins at. Um, once you decide you want to spend your coins, you come into here and you guys can pick where you want to go. Um, if you want tasting set, you'll click on this. And it'll tell you um, that you need 250 coins to redeem one tasting set. And then you would put it in here, how many you wanted to redeem. And then when you go to check out where you normally order tasting sets, it would show up as a credit. Same thing with the business building credit. Same thing here. You'd pick how many you wanted to convert. And then when you go to buy your business supplies, your credit would be right there as well. Same logo where um, the only thing that's different is your Thrive Experiences. You guys can actually turn your coins into hotel credit. A lot of people were using these this past year to pay for their room at Harvest. Um, I was going for the cruise. I was just a couple hundred points short of the cruise. Um, I had 9,700 coins last year, guys, and I needed 9,600 to get the cruise. Um, so coins go from Harvest year to Harvest year. So they start July 1st, and they'll go to the end of June that they'll, they will accrue. Um, during the whole month of, after they, after they finish in June, you have 30 days to spend what is left over for those coins before they disappear. So if you're saving your coins in case you're trying to make the trip, um, and you, if you don't make it like I didn't make mine, um, you then have the whole month of July to spend your coins that you've accrued all year long. So I bought um, a flat screen TV, a knife set, and some wine, some good stuff. Um, and this goes through the different options of what you can spend your stuff on. And if you guys click on the market, 
the market's actually going to bring you to a different screen. Where's my do it? Go, go, go. Mine is not working tonight. We try hitting this again. But the market that you get into is actually pretty cool. It lets you see. Um, you can break things down by category and how you want to spend. See, now, mine's not working now. Mine's just spinning. It's only because I'm on here trying to show you guys. Here we go. Here we go. Okay. You can break down your categories. Like last year, like I said, I had um, between this amount. So you would click that. And it's going to bring up everything you can possibly redeem with your points. So there's, there's the TV I got right there. So you can go through here. You guys can see there's some pretty cool stuff. Um, just put in your points and you're able to flip through there. There's some really cool stuff. A lot of people were getting designer handbags and system glasses. I think um, Carrie Baxter got um, a pair of sunglasses. It's not letting me back up. Okay, let me see if I can trick it. The system's a little slow tonight. Okay. So I also wanted to tell you guys, if you're thinking about earning the incentive trip, I'm going to show you guys where to find that information on how to earn that trip. I was, um, I got to go last year on last year's incentive trip. It's amazing. If you guys can earn one, definitely go for it. Um, down here in marketing tools, you can click that. And under the promotion will be um, the Thrive um, P PDF. I've already got it pulled up here. Okay. This is going to tell all the rules and stuff for the trip. Okay. Um, what's important for you guys to know is if you guys are brand new, your qualifications are different than mine. They skew it so it, um, no matter when you're joining the business, um, they can make it so you can earn it. So right now, if you've been a wine guide since um, June of last year, you have to hit Thrive for nine months. You have to have, is this? $16,000 in volume, oh, $18,000 in personal volume, and you have to have um, 8,000 Thrive points, okay? But if you guys are brand new, your qualifications are right here. Like, um, Brittany, did you start in October? You're October, right? So Brittany started in October. She has to hit Lux for eight months. She has this many coins and this much personal volume between now and June 30th. Um, anybody joining the business um, this month, this is what they need, and down through. And this is where it's handy to go back through and use that Thrive Planner to plan out how you want to earn that trip. So you can see if it's possible or not. Um, see, according to mine, I've got this many points for the whole year, but I haven't gone through and filled out all of mine. Um, some people do theirs for the entire year at once. I plan mine out two months ahead of time. Um, and except for my big goals, like you guys can see, I threw in my promotion for Ruby here by February. So that's when I want that. But everything else, um, I do it two months at a time and plan through. Here are all the official rules. You guys can read through that on your own time of how it would, um, of the of the terms for getting the getaway but um this year they're going to the riviera in cancun it looks amazing for next january and um you guys will be seeing in january um this january that a couple of us will be going to um jamaica like heather cass will be going um gina divine and kate contento were the three this past year that earned that trip so um, did you guys have any questions? That's everything that I wanted to go over in a nutshell. I know I kind of went a little fast, but um, I'm recording this as well. Did you guys have any more, any questions about the Thrive system and how it works? No, no more questions? Okay. Do you guys have any questions about anything else you want to ask me while we're on? I actually don't. 
Okay. Let me stop recording then real quick. Um,